An old abandoned building in downtown Nashville could soon have a new life, and it's thanks to some special educators. The Tennessee Education Association is working with Metro to bring the old Ben West Library building back to its original purpose, education. News Channel 5's Jesse Knutson has details. As the Ben West Library stands now, there are no books inside, no chairs, no tables, just the potential for a new life. When we first walked in here, it was clear that the building had been abandoned for a long time, but you could just see the good bones of this building. Originally built to replace the old Carnegie Library, this building has sat with the Capitol in plain view since 1966. Before the new library on Church Street was built, I mean, this was the hub of reading for the city for many years. It was originally built with education in mind. Now the Tennessee Education Association has put forward a more than $12 million proposal to preserve and renovate the building into the new TEA headquarters. It's exciting for us because, you know, quite frankly, the teachers are going to save the library. The renovation would not only create offices for TEA, but make it into a state-of-the-art facility for metro schools, teachers, and educators. The first floor would be renovated into a large auditorium with a theater on the second floor and offices for the TEA employees. We're the statewide teachers organization and this will provide ample space for us to bring those teachers from across the state for meetings, conventions and assemblies. Metro Council still has to approve the sale, but if everything goes as planned, TEA would hope to have the property renovated and open for business by the end of the year. In Nashville, Jesse Knudsen, News Channel 5. In order uh, to afford the Ben West Library, the TEA will have to sell their current facility, which is on 2nd Avenue, but they don't anticipate that being an issue.